Thank you very much. Good afternoon. And joining us in this conversation is Richard uh, Tinkasimire Baguma, uh, civil society activist, and of course the Uganda Health Communication uh, Alliance coordinator. Uh, in terms of uh, to yesterday's passing of the Tobacco Control Act and probably the bill into the act, uh, welcome to this discussion and tell us, of course, you've put in quite a number of efforts in ensuring that this bill passes into an act. There must be a mood uh, currently or, or over hovering on the air after the bill has been passed. I mean, no question, Alan. Thank you very much for, first of all, WBS being part of the process mm. of protecting the health of Ugandans, the current and future generations. Because the Tobacco Control Bill, now act awaiting assent by His Excellency the President, is about protecting public health. And I can assure you that the parliament of this country the media of this country, the civil society organizations, and the government itself have been together in passing this. And there is a mood of excitement mm. among the who have pushed it. Mm. Uh, first of all, yes, of course, the, contro the controversies surrounding the passing of this bill into an act still are around. Mm -hmm. And I hope you must be having fears about some yes, of these Yes, yes, we have anxieties. What, yeah, what are, what are some of the these? The first one is that we think, the, because the tobacco industry is a big, multi-billion industry, mm. we think they are going to go to His Excellency the President to try and interfere with the process that, of that He doesn't assent uh, to the bill? He hasn't. He, no, no, you see what happens is they go and interfere, they tell him lies so that he can send it to Parliament. But we have heard the President speak over time, and his uh, comments, his sentiments have been very clear. Tobacco control is on top of his agenda, and we think he will assent. The worry is the practice of the tobacco industry. This is what they do worldwide whenever a tobacco control law is passed. They always go to court to challenge this. We think they are going to do that in Uganda. The reality of this bill, uh, Richard, of course, one of them being that the fact is uh, we are looking at the control of the tobacco use in uh, the country and the world, of, of course, uh, but specifically in this country. But the fear that remains uh, ar around the industry is a reality. Uh, t take us through as we conclude this discussion. No, no, as far as I'm concerned, there are no fears. We are saying that tobacco kills more than 5 million people in the world. We think in Uganda it kills about 15,000 people annually. 10% of them die because they are involuntarily taking in tobacco smoke. Mm -hmm. So we kill them when they don't want. And for us, we have no fears about this. All the fallacies, all the lies, all the untruths that are peddled by the tobacco industry, that tobacco control legislation, in fact, undermines incomes of the country. That is not true. There is no research to support that. Well, of course, we'll be putting all our eyes on whether the president assents to this bill. And, of course, uh, that will be merry for many of the likes of uh, the uh, civil society organizations which have been at most. And, of course, the mover as well. I saw Honorable Chris Barimons excited about the bill. Absolutely. <laughs> and surely that is all we'll be waiting uh, for. But a uh, key in the message as we await the assenting of the bill. One of, there are several places, but for me the most important is this country has passed a law to say all public places, irrespective whether it's an entertainment place, whether it's an educational institution, whether it's a prison, whether it's a police station, it's saying it's 100% tobacco smoke free. Don't allow anyone to smoke in any public place where you are. Tell them it is illegal and against the law and they can be arrested. The afternoon edition continues. Thanks very much for joining us. And of course, uh, on a set with us was uh, Richard Tinker, Simira Baguma, Uganda Health Communications Alliance, uh, giving us a brief after the passing of the, un of the tobacco control bill, indeed, uh, yesterday in Parliament. Uh, and of course, we'll be looking at the assenting of the bill, I mean, of the act uh, by the president. Good afternoon. Thanks very much for staying with WBS. Thank you for hosting me.